Welcome to the first of a series of vlogs. I mean, I know they are technically called vlogs, but I'm just not quite comfortable saying that. So here are some videos of some stuff that I like that I'm gonna talk about. I'm gonna be talking about parenting tips and tricks I think are really useful, products that I've tried and I think are brilliant, and shops that I've been to, what are lush. The first shop that I'm gonna talk about is And Other Stories. Now it's a bit of a mouthful and the and is the and sign, not that one or the word, but the sign. Um, so if you wanna Google it, that's pretty helpful. It is a beautiful shop. The shopping experience, although I hate that phrase, but it's quite useful here. The shopping experience is gorgeous. The store is just off Oxford Street. And so if you've got a meeting around there, I would recommend you get there 45 minutes early. That shop is gorgeous to go into. I personally find the clothes don't sit well on my body. They're really unflattering, but the accessories, you're gonna be in trouble. It, it's accessory heaven. So, the first one I've got to talk about is this absolute beauty of a bag. I mean, it's perfect. It's the perfect bag, actually perfect. So, it's a perfect size. It's not so big you can put loads of stuff into it. And especially as a mum, I find that I fill my bags full of crap. Actually, because it's quite little, you have to be careful about what you put in it, but it fits an iPad, a small laptop, bottle of water, makeup, done, it's perfect. It's got some really nice compartments, not too many. Look at that. You know, nice big main body of the bag. Nice little one at the front. But my favorite bit about this bag is the way it does up. Yeah, it, oh, look at that action. Oh, it's so nice, look. And you can do that. And I sometimes do that all day long. I mean, what woman doesn't want a bag that does that? Exactly, every woman. Um, that bag was about in the region of 140 pounds. So not cheap, but it's so well made. I give it a proper bashing every single day and it looks almost brand new. So I think that's pretty good quality. Uh, the next thing I bought was this fabulous hat. Now it's great for winter because essentially it's a bit like an umbrella because it's got a very wide rim here. It's got a girthy rim. Um, and that means that when it rains, it raineth not on your lovely outfit or your face. Uh, it just rains around you. Um, the problem with the hat is that they're a bit of a faff. You know, they, you look great for approximately five minutes and then you end up by taking it off and putting it back on. Your hair's a mess. So the hat's got to be amazing for me to justify carrying it around all day and it being annoying. This is very good quality. It's quite thick, um, so it won't leak. It's a bit of a weird thing to say, isn't it? Anyway, it's a hat that won't leak. It's got a nice buckle detail, which makes me feel like a cowgirl. It's great. Um, the next thing that I bought were these very excellent sunnies. I do love them. They're quite feline, which I think is always very flattering on a woman's face. My brother is laughing behind <laughs> the camera. Yeah, they look nice, all right? Um, my brother's filming this very kindly. Um, so I think those are, those are really good. Those were in the region of £35. Um, all the details of this shop will be on my website. So the exact price and the information for the shop, you can find it there. That's, those aren't cheap sunglasses. If you're like me, you sit on sunglasses regularly and my son's favorite game is to pull them like this. Ah! So these are actually quite expensive for that to happen. So I'm, I'm really trying to look after those properly. The last thing I bought, well actually the last two things I bought were this t-shirt, um, and it's just a black t-shirt, you know, I'm not gonna um, stand up and do a Mexican wave about it, it's just a black t-shirt, but it's very comfortable, it's very nice, and I think it sits nicely. Um, but really, what I'd like to talk about is this jumper, because it's getting cold, you know, we're all in denial, but winter is a coming, and I thought this is very nice. Most of the clothes, yeah, like I say, they don't look good on me, but, I thought this was a really nice, really nice jumper. And um, I like the way the polo neck kind of sits around your jawline, which again, I think is very flattering. Uh, the, the Edwardians knew what they were doing, didn't they? Yeah, with a bit of a collar action. And I think it's quite nice because it sits snugly on my shoulders, but it's quite flared around there if I'm having a big pasta supper. It's 
it's got, it's got a baggy around there, so you know, I can get away with it. Um, so that is my and other stories shopping haul. All in all, I think it's a beautiful shop and um, yeah, good luck because you know, that is going to burn a hole in your plastic. <laughs> Thank you.